Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This again, so we could get started. I apologize for starting a bit late. So, um, audio video issue that we had to resolve. Sharp minds of Sharif <laughs> at the Stanford, I guess, <laughs> contributing in a negative way in this case. Anyway, my name is Jalil Kamali, and I'm your host tonight. Um, on behalf of the Sharif University of Technology Association, SUTA, I'd like to thank and welcome you all. I would also like to thank our sponsor, our fellow Sharif alumnus, Dr. Mansouri Kiramat, the CEO of Alvan Technologies. I received my bachelor degree from Sharif University in 1989 and my PhD from Stanford in 1996 both in electrical engineering. In between these two degrees, my bachelor in Sharif and my PhD at Stanford, I happened to receive another degree, a master's, from that other university in Tehran, <laughs> the old Tehran University, of which I dare to say here tonight, I'm as proud. <laughs> And if you could please turn off your cell phone, at least put it on vibration, so... Sadi, the famous Persian poet and thinker of the 13th century, is no stranger in the Western world. To the very least, in the intellectual circles, he is known for his famous poem used to grace the entrance on the Hall of Nations in the UN building in New York, which says, Human beings are members of a whole, in creation of one essence and soul. If one member is afflicted with pain, other members uneasy will remain. In his masterpiece, Kulestan, the Rose Garden, Sadi says, two pious men keep the hair between them on tour. And so does a mild with a headstrong man. If, however, both sides are fools, if there be a chain, they will snap it. While the latter approach of the fools has been widely practiced everywhere, we are fortunate that the pious men of the Stanford and Sharif universities chose the former and managed to keep the hair between them untorn despite decades of terror. This is what we recognize and celebrate. <coughs> we are honored to have a full house of distinguished guests, our speakers, Professor Woolley and Professor Lee from the Electrical Engineering Department of Stanford University, Professor Prince, the chair of the Mechanical Engineering Department of Stanford University, and Dr. Mohsen al Vice President of Engineering in Risk Management Solutions, and former Professor of Civil Engineering in Sharif University. A special welcome goes to one of the supervisors of the great city of San Francisco. Uh, I understand Mr. Ross Karimi was going to be here. I don't know whether he is here now. Oh, gentlemen is here. A special welcome to Mr. Ross Mirkani, who is with us this evening. The planning of this event started less than three months ago. The warm reception of the idea by so many great people and their sincere cooperation made it possible for us to come up with a full program of various pieces, which I hope will make you enjoy your next few hours, if the audio video <laughs> issue allows us actually and leave you with good memories. However, the most important aspects of this gathering, in my opinion, is the fact that it brought so many talented and successful individuals together, for which I would like to thank you all. We will start the program by introduction from Dr. Farib Arya, the president of SUTA. Dr. Arya, my dear friend, received her BS from Sharif University in 1979 and MS and PhD from, here comes the hard part, Université d'Orange in 1987, all in chemistry. 
1994, she founded Kimio Corp Incorporated, where she is now the CEO. Dr. Arya has been involved with SUTA since its inception in 2000 and a member of Board of Directors for six years. She has served as the president of SUTA since 2006. Please join me in welcoming Dr. Arya. 